behind me is Kennesaw Mountain. It's part of Kennesaw Mountain National Battlefield Park. And today, I'm gonna hike up the mountain. I'm gonna use my Kenwood THD 74 to make some ham radio contacts for soda. Summit's on the air. I've got uh, about a mile hike to do up the mountain. This is gonna be fun. Let's get going. Kennesaw Mountain is a Civil War battlefield. The Confederates were on top of the mountain with their Napoleon era smoothbore cannon. And when the Union showed up, they started firing from a much longer range with their rifled cannon. And uh, we're hitting the top of the mountain out of the range of the Confederates. The Confederates overnight brought up their rifled cannon to the top of the mountain. And the two sides exchanged artillery fire uh, for about a week with uh, no definitive result. If you're a historian and you correct me, please do so in the comments. Do mountains grow every year? Serious question. This trail seems to get steeper and harder every single year. I guess it's a mystery. Anyway, Summits on the Air is a points-based activity for ham radio operators. Uh, and there's a couple different ways you can earn points. Number one is to go up on top of mountains and collect at least four contacts. Depending on how high the mountain is, you get a certain number of points. Kennesaw Mountain, the mountain I'm on, is only worth two points. But there's other mountains that are worth eight and 10 in the state of Georgia. And I've gotten some of those. Anyway, you can look up online on the SOTA website, mountains in your area, and see what their point value is. The other way to earn points is by being a chaser. If you talk to somebody who's on top of a mountain, you get one point. It's a great way uh, to mix exercise, uh, being outdoors, and ham radio, uh, and it certainly is fun. So what do you need to participate in SOTA, Summits on the Air? You need your amateur radio license, you need a ham radio, and you can use any frequencies uh, or bands that you're licensed for. So for example, I'm using my handheld tri-band Kenwood THD 74. I'm going to work the two meter band. That's uh, 144 megahertz. The only stipulation is if you are a technician and you are going to use a handheld radio like this one is you can't use repeaters. That's in the rules. You have to make simplex contacts. That's radio to radio contacts without using repeaters. So for a uh, two meter band, there's a very popular, it's called the national calling frequency. It's 146.52. That's what I'm going to be calling on, trying to make my contacts. Sounds like there's some traffic on here already, some other summit on the air people, but I'm going to see if I can make a contact. I leave the squelch open because sometimes uh, the contacts can be a little hard to hear and they won't break squelch. You can hear somebody. Uh, hopefully, uh, he'll come in on his way back home. In order for a contact to count towards soda, you have to exchange call signs, signal reports, and you have to give the identifier of the mountain you're on. In this case, W4G CE001. So I'm gonna start calling. CQ Soda, Summits on the Air, Kennesaw Mountain. This is Kilo 4, Bravo, Bravo, Lima. Calling CQ, CQ, CQ Soda. K4 JFF, K4 BBL, thanks for getting back to me. Uh, your signal is 5-9, uh, real strong signal. Uh, you must be pretty close. Uh, yes, uh, that's correct. Uh, name here is Mel, uh, Mike Echo Lima. And you're also uh, Q5S9 uh, uh, plus, plus plus. And uh, I'm located uh, four miles west of you. Uh, just south of the city limits of Kennesaw, 
and uh, I'm atop uh, a small mountain called uh, Pine Mountain. Uh, this uh, mountain is uh, at 3300, 1300 feet. So uh, it does not qualify for, uh, for soda, unfortunately. Uh, back to you. Hey Mel, thanks for getting back to me. Name here is Brian. I think we've made contact before, probably when I've been on uh, Kennesaw Mountain Summit before. But yeah, that's great. I, I remember speaking to somebody on Pine Log, I believe, uh, previously. Back to you. Well, Pine Log uh, is a different mountain. I'm on Pine Mountain. Uh, this is Pine Mountain. Uh, it's a little bit higher and higher. Uh, east of uh, Cartersville. Okay, well, uh, uh, Brian, I'll let you get some more uh, contacts. So, uh, uh, good luck and uh, get lots of set of contacts. Uh, K4 Bravo Bravo Lima from K4 Juliet, Foxtrot, Foxtrot. K4 JFF, uh, this is uh, Brian again. Thanks uh, so much. I know you have it, but I'll just do it to be official. I'm making a YouTube video. I don't want anyone complaining. The uh, mountain identifier is W4G CE001. I'm sure you have it, but uh, I'm sure you talked to a lot of people up here. But thanks again for coming back to me. This is K4 BBL Clear. Uh, looking for anyone else who wants to make a soda contact, CQ Soda, K4 BBL on Kennesaw Mountain. That's one, one contact. For summits on the air, high frequency radios are very, very common. That's because uh, they have much uh, longer range. You can go over the horizon with HF radios and you can, uh, you can get out much better uh, and have much more distance with HF radios. I'm gonna be using my UHF VHF radio uh, and those are line of sight. But because I'm on top of a mountain, my line of sight is much further, so my range is extended. I could maybe make contacts with this antenna uh, five, maybe 10 miles away with just the five watts. Uh, if you're gonna do a summits on the air in a more remote location, uh, you probably wanna bring a Yagi or beam antenna for your two meter radio so that you can, um, you can get out reliably and, and aim your RF at a specific location to extend that range even more. Seems to be uh, some activity, maybe some other soda activity on the uh, two meter calling frequency. Uh, and I don't want to interfere with those. So I'm going to try the 70 centimeter calling frequency, which is 446, 446 megahertz. So here we go. CQ Soda, CQ Soda, CQ Soda, K4 BBL on Kennesaw Mountain. Does anyone copy CQ Soda? CQ Soda, CQ, CQ, CQ Soda, K4 BBL on Kennesaw Mountain, Kilo 4, Bravo, Bravo, Lima. Can anyone copy? <laughs> 70 centimeter band isn't nearly as popular as a two meter band. But there should still be some people monitoring it. I'm not sure. CQ Soda, Summits on the Air, Kennesaw Mountain. K4, BBL, Kilo 4, Bravo, Bravo, Lima, calling CQ, CQ Soda, CQ Soda, is anyone there? Guess I'll have to try to go back to two meters. CQ, 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 CQ Soda, summits on the air. I'm on Kennesaw Mountain, this is K4, BBL, calling CQ Soda. CQ, 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 CQ Soda, CQ Soda, K4 BBL on Kennesaw Mountain calling CQ. K4 BBL I think it was. Uh, this is Kilo Echo 4 Yankee. Kilo Echo 4 Yankee. Name here is Brian. I'm on Kennesaw Mountain. The mountain identifier is uh, W4G CE001 and you are a 5'9". Thanks Brian. It's a good signal report. Uh, your name? Sorry about that. Name is Dan. Dan, thanks for mu so much for being contact number two. 
I just need two more to uh, finalize this activation so I can hike down the mountain. It's windy up here. You know, windy where I am. I'm sure it's windy where you are. Well, good luck to you. I'm sure you'll get a couple more here shortly. Thank you very much. Your call sign again, just so I can sign off correctly. Uh, Kilo Echo 4 Yankee. BBL go to 55. Five. BBL go to 55. Five. K4 BBL go to 55. Five. Roger that. QSY. K2JB, K2JB, this is Kilo 4 Bravo Bravo Lima on Kennesaw Mountain. Uh, W4G CE001. Blood Mountain, awesome. That's got to be some miles away. You are a 5.9, maybe a 5.8, but uh, perfectly readable. Yeah, one more station and I can be done activating Kennesaw Mountain. Thank you. KW4JN, Summit, Summit. KW4JN, K4BBL on Kennesaw Mountain, CE001. Awesome. KW4JN, we're on NGO04 and you are 5 and 9. Thank you for the Summit to Summit. 5 9, copy that. Summit to Summit. What mountain are you on? Are you on Blood Mountain as well? And where is that, or what town is that near? It's south of Hiawassee, west of Hiawassee, Georgia. That's got to be, we got to be talking a good, what, 30 miles, maybe more? I don't know where you are, so I can't say. Kennesaw Mountain in Kennesaw, Georgia. I'll have to look it up, Hiawassee. Well, it's good talking with you. Thank you so much for the contact. Good luck on your activation. That's number four for me, so uh, I'm done. Good for you. 7-3 to you, K4, BBL clear. Awesome. All right, so that's a long distance contact. I'm gonna measure the distance and I'll put it, uh, I'll put the text right here. And yeah, so uh, really cool. Summit to Summit, those guys are up activating another mountain. I'm activating Kennesaw Mountain. That was cool. So that is four, uh, four contacts. I could go on and make more, but I wanna get on with my day. I'm gonna hike down the mountain and uh and move on but i hope you enjoyed uh, uh seeing me make some contacts up here on kennesaw mountain what a great day got out got some exercise hiked up a mountain made four contacts i activated kennesaw mountain for soda points summits on the air uh hopefully you learned something hopefully you liked the video if you did you know click that thumbs up and uh, maybe subscribe so you don't miss another one of my videos in the future. I'm gonna do some more summits on the air. You'll see more. Talk to you later. Seven threes.